Got the angle wrong. And for all mains, let's move! Get on that main seat! Why, look, it's the bastard son of the late William Kidd. Still a mere boy, and yet ten times the demon his father was. 
Fancy seeing you here, can we? Still looking sleek and mean. Did you steal that costume from a dandy in Havana? No, sir. I found this on a corpse. One that was walking about and talking shite to my face only moments before. Huh. So, what's this I hear about a planned raid on a plantation? Not keeping secrets from me, are you? Not very well. Every day, schooners packed with sugar sail past, coming from plantations nearby. Most times they stop here, sell off a few crates. There's one man visiting today that had earned you a fine profit. So if you'd like to rob his plantation, I'll point him out. I would. Is it a Mr. Beckford that owns this plantation? That's the man. He owns dozens round these islands. And he's bloody rich. Just the sort I like to see robbed. His agent is around here somewhere. Find and follow him. And he'll lead you straight to your prize. <laughs> of your enterprise here, I understand that you are men of discernment. story. Perfect. Manning, to me. We've done with this place. Aye, sir. What's our course? We'll return to the plantation and there take stock of our inventory. It's a good harvest this year. You may not talk so loud, son. Yes. This isn't anything like a friendly port, Ken. Nonsense, man. I had a delightful conversation with a chap just now. We came to quite an understanding. As you see, sir. All up and unfurl, boys. We're going home. of a man crafting a bold idea. Look, I've seen before. You mark well, I think. I've just overheard one of the Beckford's men talking grandly about his plantation and all the cargo he's keeping there. And he gave me the idea that I might take these goods off him and sell them off for a better price than he'd ever ask. <laughs> ah, a man of vision. I like this idea. Loose all! Party like! Hold on it. 
there's trouble afoot. I see them. For sale! All sale! Close down! Man your sheets! Get ahead, sir! This man is working for Peter Beckford's people. Did you know them? The Beckfords and their sugar empire. Aye. Beckfords and the Draxes. I never worked their plantations, but I knew their names from hearing other men quiz them. But you worked the plantation, no? A modest one, aye. As a striker in the boiling house. Boiling house? Was it water they boiled, or something else? Cane juices. It's a hard process making sugar. Dangerous. It must be why it fetches such a dear price. What's it like, toiling on a plantation day and night? Well, with the cane sugar cut and harvested, it's run between two metal rollers to crush the juice from the plant. After collecting the juice, it was time to boil away the water from the sugar. This we did in taxes made of cotton. But let me tell you, brother, Boiling sugar is the hottest thing on earth. Just the touch on the skin, you stick like wood lime and burn on, leaving a terrible scar. Jesus. It's a risk to anchor too close. The soldiers roving the plantation would catch us for sure. Drop here then and sneak ashore. We'll look after the jackal. such disarray. Bit of a do, sir, that's all. It's Wellington's birthday. And you saw fit to get pickled on duty. No bother, sir. We've got everything sorted. We'll soon see, won't we? For you must double the watch this evening. Double, sir? Whatever for? I believe I was followed to the By pilots, if my eyes on me. So the ship was uncommonly large for some reason. In any case, double the watch, and keep your damned eyes wide for anything suspicious. <laughs> <laughs> 